Clear prop. Now that we've done the repair and we're ready to set up to do the balance, we did, already did the inspection, we found the problem, and uh, we repaired it. So now it's just a matter of setting up the accelerometers, putting the reflective tape on the back of the prop for the photo eye. Okay. And then we'll uh, run it and see what happens. Okay. See what we get. Have at it. We've, we've set up our equipment. We have an accelerometer and a photo eye on the front. And we have an accelerometer on the rear to monitor the vibration on the rear of the engine. We line up a piece of reflective tape with our photo eye so that we can pick up the blade location when the accelerometer actually detects the vibration and determine a correction angle. It actually, the computer will actually determine a correction angle based on that. Okay. with my photo eye to give me a reference point. It gives me a reference to a clock angle of 12 o'clock. Then the computer senses and tells me where it wants to wait. Did that change thing? It wanted four grams at basically 305. Okay. And with the Lycomings with this ring gear available, what I'll do is I'll put the weight in the ring gear with an AN4 bolt. So we're, we're pretty good. Taking a single point and you've moved down. Now you couldn't get the uh, less weight at exactly the right location. Right? right. So I can split the weight and put it at two different locations okay. and achieve the same result or better, a better result. Okay. And we were at .08 on that last run. Right. Okay. Now, now that we've split it and changed it a little bit, we'll see what happens. It, we might have to make another adjustment after that. Okay. Our end result is .05. We didn't start very bad, but all we needed was a small weight, about 8.8 uh, .8 grams on an AN4 bolt in the ring gear with a lock nut. And that gave us .05, which is well within spec. You know, the safety factors of pilot fatigue and losing hardware, you know, uh, vibration is what causes things to loosen. You get cylinder hold down fasteners, you get valve cover screws, you have any of the fasteners on the engine or, you know, even up here. Uh, you get starter issues on some airplanes, you get uh, alternator issues on other airplanes. Vibration tears everything up, including the solid state stuff in the panel. Okay, all right, thank you. Sure.